Hello, I'm Dr. Tulunai Ugur. I practice at the University of Arkansas for Medical Sciences, and I'm a laryngologist, which means I see patients with swallowing, airway, and voice problems. I have a special interest in geriatric, which means aging, voice, and swallowing. I would like to talk to you today about swallowing difficulty and aging. It is unfortunately a much more common problem than realized. We are an aging population, after a certain age, after 30 years old, we start losing muscle bulk and that affects the swallowing system significantly. Unfortunately, most of the times it's dismissed as a part of normal aging and that there's nothing to do about it and can lead to significant problems such as malnutrition, which means you start losing weight, dehydration, which is dangerous and can cause you to end up uh, being admitted to the hospital or emergency room. It can cause recurrent pneumonias, which are lung infections that can actually be very serious and difficult to treat. Um, it also can cause asphyxiation, which means the food goes down the wrong way into the windpipe and you can't breathe. So it has to be noted, discussed with your primary care doctor or your ENT doctor and hopefully treat it. And the good news is there are lots of options. How do you know if you're having swallowing difficulty? Like I said, you could be coughing when you drink or eat food. This usually means the food is going down the wrong way. Uh, another significant problem is that as we age, we lose a lot of our saliva glands, so our mouth gets dry. If we don't have all of our teeth or our dentures are ill-fitting, then we can't chew the food very well. So you have to be very careful and chew the food as long as it is needed. Also, please drink water when you're eating due to the problem with dry mouth already. So if you're having um, regurgitation, if the food is getting stuck at the lower part of your neck or your chest, these are all signs of swallowing difficulty. If it is only linked to aging, then there's a lot of different things that can be done. But in order to prove that it's aging related, first your physician will do certain studies to make sure there's nothing else going on. Once it's linked to just aging, then we do different things, including therapy to strengthen your throat muscles and your tongue muscles. Um, you don't want to be drinking water very fast. You need to keep your head straight or tuck down so it doesn't go down the wrong way. So your doctor will recommend further modifications as needed. So if you need further information, please talk to your primary care physician or your ENT doctor, and you can go to enthealth.org and also find further information, enthealth.org. Thank you.